If you're looking to make online friends from other countries, you can try out this app. It's called Miko Chat from Miko World, and the app is available for free on the Google Play Store. To use Miko Chat, you'll need to have either Facebook or Google account. They do also have an option to use email or your phone number as well. Once you're logged into the service on the home screen, you will be able to see people near you. And you can also see who are new members on the service. And there is an option to filter the users by gender, location, update within days, and age as well. So let's say if I want to select a specific age group, I can do that using the app as well. To make connecting with people a little bit more fun, Miko offers a matching game. It also has a world travel mode, which connects you with, you with people uh, randomly from around the world. And you can also connect with people based on popular cities as well. If I try the world travel mode and I select let's travel, Miko will pick up a random country and it will show me a list of users from that country that I can talk to. So for me, it has selected Korea and if I want to uh, message them, I can do that. And a good thing about this service is that uh, this person speaks Korean, as I can assume. But if I was to send a message, it will actually get translated for them, which makes it very easy to have interaction with someone uh, who speaks a different language. If I wanted to connect with people from a specific region uh, by popular cities, let's say, because um, I'm moving there or I want to travel there or want to know more about the culture, uh, I can select a specific city and what it actually does is it shows me uh, users that have used the service recently um, from that specific region and then I can message them and uh, talk with them. Another feature in the app is the newsfeed. And here you can actually see what latest updates have been posted by people you follow. You can click on the hot section to see which one are the uh, latest trending posts in the community. And then there is a nearby section as well where you will see uh, posts from people near you. Something I noticed with the service is that if you like a post, it is not possible to unlike it. The most interesting section that I found in the app is the live section where uh, people are live streaming. So let's try this call out. And this one is a multi guest call. And people can do chat, they can join the guest call as well. And it appears that they have a waiting list right now. Here we have a DJ playing. In the live section, you can also watch people playing games as well. So let's see what's happening here. And here the person is playing some game. Which is pretty cool that you can actually watch people playing games. And if you want, you can actually host your own stream as well. Make sure to read the terms and conditions before you do it. Apart from being able to share images with other users through chat, the app does support video chat as well. I did get occasionally contacted by uh, bot profiles as well. So just be careful that you do not share any kind of sensitive information using the service. App does allow users to make money through the platform as well. So you can get gifts from other users and uh, something here very important to note is that it only supports Indonesian bank cards. So unless you have an Indonesian account, you would not be able to receive the money. You can also join different groups using the service. So if you are looking at friends, just go in the friends section. And if you're looking at somewhat of an internet entertainment related group you can join that one there is also for work as well if you're looking to uh, connect with people from a different uh, work background you can do that using the service as well 
the app does has um, like a virtual mall as well and it looks like people actually buy uh, virtual Porsche Lamborghini these are not real cars so I don't think that actually adds any kind of value because uh, 3000 coins is actually a lot of money um, if I was to buy these coins it would actually cost me a lot as you can see 445 gold coins is actually 7 Canadian dollars approximately overall I think it's a really good social networking platform to connect with people from other countries uh, do try out the service and let me know through comments of what you think of it thank you for watching this video bye